May I request His Excellency, the Ambassador, to address the gathering. Excellencies, dear friends, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, Namaskar, Assalamu Alaikum. Organization alaykum. and demonstrators are together. I'm delighted to welcome everyone for today's celebration of the 10th International Day of Yoga. At the outset, let me acknowledge the presence of my fellow ambassadors from Malaysia, Sri Lanka, United States, and Nepal for joining us on this occasion. I know there are several other ambassadors who were looking forward to this event. But since it happens in the middle of the summer vacations, unfortunately, they could not join us. I also wish to acknowledge the gracious presence of our Romani friends and the enthusiastic members of the Indian community who always turn up in large numbers to celebrate this occasion. I would also like to put on record my sincere appreciation, and I hope you will join me in acknowledging the very hard work put in by all the volunteers of Indian, social, Indian School Muscat and other organizations in putting together this mega event. Ladies and gentlemen, the International Day of Yoga celebrated annually on June 21st was a brainchild of our Prime Minister, Sri Narendra Modi. This idea that he proposed to the United Nations was adopted not just with consensus but by acclamation by all member states and since then, it truly has become a global festival, a global festival of holistic health, a global festival of societal harmony, and a global festival of collective well-being. This year, we are celebrating the 10th International Day of Yoga, and what better to celebrate with communities in such large numbers. Dear friends, yoga is all about balance. Balance within, balance without. Balance within ourselves, between our physical self, our mental self, and our spiritual self. Balance also between our individual selves and the society, with the outside world. We realize that when we maintain these balances, we live happier, healthier, and more productive lives. When we maintain these balances, we also engender social harmony. We engender societies which are more productive, which are more harmonious, which are one with nature. This year's theme for the 10th International Day of Yoga is Yoga for Self and Society. This reflects the profound impact yoga has on both individual well-being and social well-being. Yoga promotes the oneness of body, mind and soul. As the Bhagavad Gita says, yoga is not just a physical exercise. It is, it is a journey of the self, through the self, to the self. And these principles are particularly relevant in today's world, racked at as it is with unprecedented challenges such as wars, conflicts, climate crises, natural calamities, and of course, lifestyle diseases and stress. Dear friends, with all your support, in the last few years, the popularity of yoga in the Sultanate of Oman has gone through the charts. And I must appreciate the wholehearted support of the government of the Sultanate of Oman and the support of the friendly people of Oman in making this happen. In 2022, we took a small initiative of popularizing yoga through the Muscat Yoga Mahotsav also to commemorate the 75 years of India's independence. We started off by the aim of doing 75 events that year, but I'm happy to report that we ended up doing more than 150. Last year, this was followed up with another initiative, another marathon called the Oman Yoga Yatra that took yoga to all parts of this beautiful country and took yoga to everybody, the entire all parts of the population, young and old, men and women. A highlight of last year's initiative also was a very special video that we produced called Soulful Yoga Serene Oman. This was the first time that yoga was used by a foreign country to promote tourism. In this case, of course, I'm talking about Oman. This year, we are celebrating the yoga marathon in the form of Marhaban Yoga. 
health, healing and harmony. Underscoring the essential values of yoga for our lives. We have so far conducted more than 30 events all across Oman. This time last week in, on Friday, I was in Salala where we undertook a marquee event with the Indian community and participation of the Omani community from Salala. This morning, yoga was performed on the Indian warship INS Tarkash, which is currently birthed in Salala as well. So ladies and gentlemen, we hope we will have a great session today. I wish everyone a great 10th International Day of Yoga. Let us, ladies and gentlemen, bend it like Bharat. Let us make yoga a part of everyone's life, our lives. Marhaban yoga, marhaban good health. Thank you very much. Namaskar. Jai Hind.